you will make noise in your own home. But please try to keep the level down. The following may help. Keep speakers and TVs away from the walls backing onto your neighbours and keep them off the floors. Don't use hoovers or washing machines when your neighbours are likely to be sleeping. And if you're asking friends to visit your home, think about the noise they will make and work out how you can keep it as low as possible. Your neighbours will be very grateful. The best way to deal with the problem is to speak with a member of our staff about the matter and how you would like to see it resolved. If you're still unhappy, you can take things forward by using our complaints procedure. The time it takes us to carry out repairs depends on how urgent it is. For example, if you have a burst pipe, of course we will be there as soon as we can. However, a dripping tap is not going to be fixed as quickly. Also, some repairs may take longer if we have to order a part to finish the job. Some repairs are covered by law. This is called the right to repair. We'll tell you more about this when you contact us. If you have a repair that is an emergency and the office is closed, you'll have to phone our out of hours service. The number can be found in your handbook and on our website. Please remember that this is an emergency repair service only. We'll make your home safe and secure, but we might have to come back to finish the job. It's important to remember that our insurance only covers our buildings, not your belongings. We would expect you to get contents insurance to make sure you're covered for things like fires, leaks or break-ins. The monthly premiums may not be as much as you think. If you want to keep a pet, you'll need to contact us to see if pets are allowed in your home. If you are allowed to keep a pet, you're expected to look after it properly. This includes making sure it doesn't make a mess or a noise that disturbs the neighbours. If you're not looking after your pet properly, you'll have to find another home for it. If you want to end your tenancy, you must give us 28 days notice. If you are a joint tenant, you must make sure it is signed by both of you. We will check your home before you leave and we'll let you know if there are any repairs you need to sort out before you go. You must leave your home in good condition. We will charge you if there is any work you should have done before you left. 